Day six, y'all. It's Becky Brosette, Transform 20, and we are done with week one. How are you feeling? I know I'm feeling energized and positive and focused on what's going on in my mind because, guys, what we tell ourselves, it comes out. It comes out in the way we carry ourselves. It comes out the way we speak, the way we treat people, the way our body looks. If there's constant negativity going on here, believe me, you are pushing out negativity onto the world. And this program is going to change that because we are here to bust through barriers, bust through the excuses, bust through those stories that you have told you, yourself all your life as to why you cannot succeed. Yes, you can. If I can, you can. So today is balance. I loved it. It's a slower pace. It focuses on stretching, but you're going to work. Believe me, you're going to work your entire body while focusing on the core. And while I'm talking about the core, a lot of people have poor balance. And guys, I want you to focus on this. This is important. The reason why I say this is because of the older generation. I am seeing my, my parents, my mom, I've, my grandmother has always had very, very poor balance overweight and that is causing major problems right now because now they're getting older and balance gets worse as you get older you take a step you can't really recalibrate your body and they fall break breaking bones left and right fractures broken hips we need to prevent that and that happens now in our youth the core of us this is the core needs to strengthen so while you're doing this workout please engage the cage this right here, the butt area from here to here is your core. You need to keep it tight and engaged. That is what's going to keep you uplifted, but also with good balance. We need that. It's not just for fitness. Balance is for life. So Shanti is going to keep talking about that, about balance and how you implement that into your life. Some people say that a balanced life is a figment of your imagination. But I think in essence, you do need balance. You need to take care of yourself, okay? And that's what Transform 20 is for. And that is a huge aspect of why we are showing up every day, to pull out our best selves. So do the workout. Stretch at the end. Really focus on getting the most out of every move. Yes, it's going to burn, but celebrate that. Instead of using the old techniques of telling yourself, no, I can't, how about you flip the switch? Let's change the mentality, change the language, and say, yes, I can because I am alive and use the gift of being on this earth today present as the reason why you should push through every single move to the best of your ability. Again, this is your race. Don't compare yourself to anyone else. We're here to make our own selves better than we were yesterday. So guys, nutrition, is hard on the weekends, I get it. But honor yourself and eat high quality food. Stay away from the junk. The junk is not gonna get you anywhere. Ask yourself the question when you're leaning towards that pizza or that burger. Is this pizza slice of pizza gonna get me closer to my goals? Is it going to destroy or maybe just loosen the reins a little bit when I have gained so much momentum? Don't do it, it's not worth it. You're gonna kick yourself in the tail afterwards and it's not worth it. Go for something that's gonna make you feel energized and proud that you stayed consistent with your program. If you have questions, please feel free to reach out to me. Get ready for week two, meal prep on Sunday, hydrate, sleep well, drink your Shakeology, and don't forget to honor yourself each and every day. I'll talk to you on Monday.